let's dive into your task library. So on the left navigation, you're going to click on the dumbbell icon, and this is where all of your tasks are going to live. Now, as you are building out your library, your list of tasks is going to get very, very long. So you'll see that we have, whoops, uh, pagination down here so you can flip through the pages as you need to but realistically it's a lot easier to use the search bar so if you want to edit a task or find a task start typing it in up here and it will pull up uh, what is related all right so now let's create a task by clicking create task now the really neat thing is a task could be literally anything so maybe it's an exercise maybe it's a full warm-up video maybe it's a, a recipe or something else nutrition related or a habit you know, you're only limited by your own creativity. So, um, you know, I think what you need to call your mom. All right. That's going to be our task for today. Create task. Right. And then you can add a video note from either YouTube or Vimeo. So you'll copy the link and paste it here. Click update and you'll see the video loads and then any task notes that you want associated with this task. Right. And then once you're done, click done. Now that has been added to our task library. So there are two ways for us to edit a task. If you want to edit the name of a task, all you have to do is come in here. Uh, and that's it for the name. Pretty simple. And then go over to actions and we can click the edit property and you can, you know, make any changes to the video note or task notes and then just hit done and it will be updated. Now you will notice the column that says status. So tasks that are in the on position where it is to the right and you can see the blue that means the task is on and so what that means is when you are in the plan builder and you start typing in a task that list that uh pops up is is including all tasks that are in the on position so if i were to turn this off now this task will not show up in that generated list okay let me turn that back on so we can't delete a task, but we can deactivate it. Or if you, you know, totally just messed it up and you want to change it, you'll just change the name of the task, change the, the video and the notes and voila, all gone. Uh, so you'll also see that we have some icons here. So we have the video icon, which means that there is a video associated with this task. And then you'll also see the speech bubble icon, which means that there are task notes associated with that task. Now, keep in mind that as you assign uh, tasks in a plan or create a plan with these tasks, if you edit them within the plan, it will automatically update in the task library as well. So it's, a, it's kind of a living, breathing task library. So if you make edits outside of the task library, it will also update in the task library. So that way you don't have to go back and forth and make sure things update as necessary. Uh, so it just happens like magic. All right? And that is your task library.